RSR family. This is one that I have been waiting for ever since I've watched this movie. It's opened up like a whole Pandora's box. I've been obsessed with like the mafia. I've been watching documentaries. films, documentaries, like on YouTube. Oh, it's completely like taking me over all because of this film. Today, guys, we are getting back to an awesome one, Godfather 2. But before we do that, if you guys are new, welcome to Rob Squad Movie Reactions. Welcome to the home theater. You are here on Mondays and Fridays with your boy Jay. Hey, y'all. You're also here with your girl Amber. And this is one of those films that I initially was not very excited about because I just thought that it was just going to be nothing but violent and although it was violent i'm not gonna say it wasn't cool. they had great dialogue to it great acting to it such a great storyline and just the the plot of everything that happens within the family is really really cool so i'm actually ready to get into godfather 2 today you come to me Oh, not again. He, I've been driving been, her nuts. It's been over a month since we've watched this film, maybe two, and he still hasn't I'm gotten still better talking. at it. He said he's still talking. I'm saying he hasn't gotten better at it. He's not still trying. He hasn't gotten better. But guys, we're ready to jump right into Godfather Part 2. Make sure you guys like the video, hit that subscribe button, and turn on that post notification bell so you never miss a video. As we always say, grab your favorite drink, your favorite snack, and Blanket. let's check out Godfather Part 2. Let's get it. really wanted no part in the life, remember? Don't you remember at the end of the last one how much, man, they went after him. Oh yeah, this and uh, Reservoir Dogs was a cool one too. Even though I wasn't so much mafia. Right. Open too. Out in the wide open. Oh. Hello. They they got the little boy. He can be. He can be. No, I don't like scenes like this. Not with kids. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Where'd the shots come from? Oh, boy. Look how dark is this game that they're in. Facciamo le mani, Don Ciccio. Don Ciccio, ma ammazzasti a me, marito. E chi non si posi calare. Eppure figlio mio Ranni, Paolo. E chi hai via giurato vinnita. The little boy sort of ends. Avi solo novanni ed è fissa. Poi avi avu cuzzanica. Io non mi scando di parola, sai. Ma il figlio mio è sì. Chi tu che sciuscia una batta? Se quando cresce, cresce forte. Ossia non si scanto. Vicirino non ci può fare niente. She's begging for him to not harm him. She said you've already taken his dad, his older brother. Quando è grande, se ne viene per fare vennetta. Che piacere, Vinci. Sparagnatemi, sto figlio mio. Tengo solo a chiesto. Yeah, it's all she has left. Signor Zumio, vi giuro che non fa niente, oh signoria. Mus paragnas. This poor woman has to go and ask for him to grant her son favor after he took her oldest. Pizza Tilly! Mazzo! Ferme! Pizza Vazzini! Ammazzatelo! Ammazzatelo! Oh, this little boy is going to be by himself. Don Ciccio viene a sapere che qualche famiglia ha ammucciato per Cirillo Pitandolini. Mm. Malamente finisci. Avete capito? Sì o no? So nobody can even help the boy. Are they gonna get them? State attenti! Ascutate chi non capisce con Mario Mosca! Stai a walking out, spreading the message. Like, this, like at their own speaker system. Ammucciato per Cirillo a Pitandolini. Segnasse a Novaus che è il meglio per tutti. He said he's not going to spare him. He said, because when he gets older, he'll seek revenge. No matter if the boy could, did not speak. Non this come back. He's saying it'll be better for the boy and you. Oh, 
Is that even look at him? Twice more. What a tragic backstory. She went there to spare her son's life. And he said no, she was willing to risk it all. How in the world is he supposed to make it by himself? What the heck are they checking his under his eyelids for? When these people came into America, mm -hmm. this many people. They have to go to customs and yeah, all that. that yeah. All this looks confusing. What is your name? Come on, son. What is your name? Tuo nome, Vito Andolini from Corleone. Corleone, Vito Corleone. Okay. He just changed his Over last there. name. Next. Wait, that could be beneficial for him. Being a Corleone, yeah. Not, no, not having Andolini as his last name if that man's looking for him. For, oh, he thinks he's going to get revenge. Tell him he has smallpox, quarantine, three months. Il dottore ha detto che hai il vaiolo, devi andare per tre mesi in quarantena all'isola I know they didn't give him any more, but my dad had a small smallpox scar because he got the smallpox shot and really? it gave him like a small little Save. And then I never thought we'd live through an epidemic. I never thought that. Never. never. He's got a quarantine there for three months. Three months? That's what they said, yeah. <gasps> He doesn't speak, but he sings. That's his grandson, Anthony Corleone. He is a Christian custodian in Mantua, Vita Maternum, Doriani Mantua, Vita Maternum, Dominus, he is a Christian custodian in Mantua, Vita Maternum. So now we're back to present day. Oh. Ooh. Where'd they say that's at? Tahoe? Nevada? I think that's what it said. Mama. Oh, Father Carmelo. This is Father Carmelo, our family priest. Mama. You know who that is. It's Rocky's girl. That's Adrian. For me and uh, my wife, Mrs. Gary, we see Nevada far too seldom. But particularly today, when we can join with old friends, we can make new friends, and we help celebrate young man's first communion. And also... Look at those cameras. Mm-hmm. We also have as a special added attraction the Sierra Boys Choir, who have uh, All this for a voice. chosen a mm -hmm. certain mm -hmm. special song, special arrangement, to honor their host, <laughs> Mr. Michael Corleone. So now we saw how they got their name Corleone. I know that's kind of cool yeah. just because the guy at Customs messed yeah. it up. So this little boy's communion is the little bit we saw playing in the garden of his with his grandfather when he finally did pass. They will be in Klingman's name. Turnbull is a good man. Yeah, well, let's, let's cut out the bullshit. I don't want to spend any more time here than I have to. Dang. You're going to have a license. Away. Price is $250,000, plus a monthly payment of 5% of the gross. Ooh. Of all four hotels. Oh. All four? Dang. Now, the price for the license is less than $20,000. Am I right? That's right. Now, why would I ever consider paying more than... Mm, dang. I don't like your kind of people. I don't like to see you come out to this clean country in your oily hair, dressed up in those silk suits, trying to pass yourselves off as decent Americans. Dang, how offensive. The fact is that I despise your masquerade, the dishonest way you pose yourself, yourself and your whole fucking family. Dog, uh -oh, you, you talk about his messed family. up. Senator, we're both part of the same hypocrisy, but never think it applies to my family. 
Yeah, he said, you, you can talk about me. Don't don't talk about my family. No, now on, you deal with turn. What are you do, sir? Um, Senator, you can have my answer now if you like. Uh -huh. My offer is this, nothing. Leaving the fee for the gaming license, which I would appreciate if you would put up personally. I might pay for the license. He said, you going to pay for my stuff now. Good afternoon, gentlemen. He's not hey, I didn't know you were out here. Honey, we have to go before the He said, you trying to squeeze me? You hmm. have my answer right now. I'm paying nothing now, and you're gonna pay it for me, boss. <laughs> With a straight face too. Man, that man was so nice on stage too. And then once they got behind closed doors. See, like that's why that's why like, I'm fascinated with the mafia. Like they're so the facade. They're in. They're intelligent. Like the way they scheme. So much different than like a gang. Mm -hmm. They have rules. Organized. Yeah, very organized. <laughs> I'm not advocating for crime, by the way. I know! I know! You son of a bitch! You look great! Ray Pantangeli! You remember Fredo from the last one? Sir? Hey, Fredo. You remember uh, Willie Chi Chi with his old man Clemenza? Where Fredo went to do all the business in Vegas, mm -hmm. if, I'm, if I'm right. I don't know. I don't remember. I think he well. was. He was sent to Vegas. That's what I mean to see your brother Mike about. I mean, what's good? I mean, what do I got to do? Do I have to get a letter of introduction or to get a sit down? You can't get in to see Mike? Got me waiting in the lobby. There's a bunch of people waiting on him. Is there anything I can do? Anything I can send? He appreciates your concern, Mike. And your respect. The casino you're interested in. The registered owners are Jacob Lawrence, Alan Barkley, both Beverly Hills attorneys. The real owners are the old Lakeville Road group from Cleveland and our friend in Miami. They try to buy up all these hotels and stuff. He owns a piece of it too. He does all right. But I've been instructed to tell you that if you move Klingman out, our friend in Miami will go along. So it's business. Everything's just business. Prison. Deported. Hyman Roth is the only one left because he always made money for his pop. <laughs> I can't believe, out of 30 professional musicians, there isn't one Italian. Come on, let's have a talent day. I like his personality. I think he's had a little too many drinks. His candor. <laughs> Pop goes the weasel. You're horrible. I'll see my sister alone. It concerns me too. Is it okay if I stay? How are you, honey? You met Merle. He was with me in Vegas. I saw him with him. He doesn't have a good history with her exes, with her mm. past boyfriends or husbands. So. Al, would you please get him a drink? Took care of him. I'm going to Europe next week. I'd like to book passage on the Queen. So what do you come to me for? Why don't you go to a travel agent? We're getting married first. She's a far cry from what she was in the first movie, isn't she? If you don't listen to me and marry this man, you'll disappoint me. I wonder what her answer was. This party's gone all day and all into May the night. Man, isn't it? I've never been to a, what they call it was, a, a communion? First communion is what I said. Never been to one, but these things is all day, all night, like you said. For a hundred years, the family. Still with her. True, if my father were alive. Merle, you've met my sister-in-law, Deanna, Fredo's wife. My pleasure. My kiss to do is in Jesus. Hey, Marge, you may need to me. No, Miguel, I'm excusado. But he, he's like just a drunk uncle. Respeto, in zoom the carpe manjad. She's out, she's out. That's his wife. Yeah, I was thinking the same yeah, thing. I, that's not Fredo. Oh, you couldn't tell your mama. They go so crazy when it comes to their wives. Here's this. I have to. Never marry a wife. Wife like shit. Uh -oh. I just need to say, whoa, oh, back up. Ah! Ah! Took her all kicking and yeah. screaming. And he said, hey, you do it. Thank you. They feel cheated. Are you sitting high up in the Sierra Mountain and you're drinking, uh, what's he drinking? Champagne. Champagne, champagne cocktail. And you're passing judgment on how I run my thing. Tua familia, ancora porta il nome de Corleone. E tu sempre devi di rispettati. Mmm, so you run it with some more honor. You're a good old man. I like you. You were loyal to my father for years. It was not a brothers. 
to take an hostages. Mike, they spit right in my face. All because they're backed up by that Jew in Miami. I know. That's why I don't want to touch them. Oh, the dude in Miami who he's about yeah, to I know work the with. I saw the name he mentioned, too. You know, they do violence in their, in their grandmother's neighborhood. I tell you, everything was... He said they do violence in their grandma's neighborhood. He respected him. Your father did business with Hyman Roth. Your father respected Hyman Roth. Your father never trusted Hyman Roth. Sicilian messenger boy, Johnny Ola. I don't want my school's heart. He's on your stango. He's on your belly heart. <laughs> we knew he was a little John, uncle. Don't go to on. Cheech. Up on. Damn. You want him to leave now? Let him go back to New York. I've already made my plans. No man had too much wine. No, but at the same time, I do, I do get the old man. Like, you go, we're supposed to be family, and you're gonna do business with some guys that really spit in my mm -hmm. face. So I get his side too, for sure. How's the baby? Sleeping inside me. Does it feel like a boy? Yes, yes, it does, Michael. I remember, she's not okay with what this business is. Mm -hmm. It made me think of what you once told me. In five years, the Corleone family will be completely legitimate. That was seven years ago. I know. I'm trying, Doc. It's just so weird seeing him as the Don. Still, like, I'm still not I used know. to him being the Don. He started off just trying to protect his dad in the mm. hospital. I want to know who his underboss is, though. Like it. Oh. <laughs> Michael, why have the drapes open? Oh. Oh, no. She noticed the drapes were open. Somebody was in there to open them so they could get a clear shot. Okay. You're right. Weird. Oh, she got lucky. It's over. It's over. <laughs> That's terrifying. They have a child in the home. Oh. They're locking everything to see if they can get whoever is in there still there. They're still on the property. Please stay inside. Right. We'll try. Marco! Alive! Stay by the door. Who do you think did? It could, with this business, it could be so many different people. But that was bold. Look at him on the property. They had to be in the house to open the blinds. But look how many dudes he got on property, though. I'm, I'm, I'm saying now like, the dogs are out. Look how many security guys he has. He has to. <laughs> Do they have two children on the property? Oh no, his niece, his nephews are probably there mm -hmm. too because of his sister's kids. Yeah. <laughs> She's probably upset. That's a mama bear right there. It's like, my babies are in the house. And you know, he didn't intend for that to happen with his business. Like soon Some as people he, ain't gonna follow the rules. As soon as, as, soon, as soon as she said that, you see his face, he was like, wait, and then jumped out the mm -hmm. way. Such a large property. Oh, and they had a party too. So somebody mm -hmm. could have easily opened them during the party. But he's weak and he's stupid. And this is life and death. You're my brother. I always wanted to be thought of as a brother by you, like a real brother. You're gonna take over. You're gonna be the dad. What? He he realized it hits his kids. You know he cares about his wife and his kids. This happened. This happened. I'm gonna leave here tonight. I give you complete power, Don. Fredo and his men. Rocco, Neri, everyone. Really? Very, very frighteningly botched. It. But your people, with Rocco and Neri, you don't think that they had something to do with this? You see. All our people are businessmen. He thinks it's inside? The one thing I learned from Pop was to try to think as people around you think. Now on that basis, anything's possible. Ah! Right, right out my window! I want to get out of here! They're lying dead! He said, he said I, my guess is they're already gone. Who is Because this? somebody that's already here got to them because they were afraid they messed it up. It was going to give them away. There's two of them. Looks like they were hired out of New York. I, I don't recognize them. We won't get anything out of them now. No information. Fisherman. Who do you think did it? So 
the one on the inside. It's gotta That's be. That's what he said. I'm so confused right now. I know. Because now the other brother's in charge. It's not the way I saw this movie. So no. Go. Anthony. Tom ain't got the personality to be the Don. Did you like your party? I got lots of presents. I know. Did you like them? I didn't know the people who gave them to me. Hmm. They were friends. Did you see my present for you? It was on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Will you take me? No, I can't. Why do you have to go? Because I have to do business. I could help you. Someday you will. No, I want him to help you one day. Sweet. So I don't know what he's going away for, but his brother's in, I'm thinking maybe in charge until he gets back. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm trying to figure out too. Like, why is he going away? What's he? Old school theater. Mm-hmm. Wow, that's beautiful. It is beautiful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That woman's hair is so long and beautiful. Tofanucci. Oh. 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 The Black Hand is not signing a good name for somebody you just maybe insulted. Romani, Romani, Romani. Carla, what do you mean? Ah, that's his daughter. Did you hear that though? He's Italian. Why does he bother all other mm. Italians? He's like, because he knows no, there's nobody there to protect. <laughs> This one's just starting off a little slower than the, the first one did. I like it though, because there's a lot of storyline to it. Dialogue and going back. So next week I'll come and get it. What's in there for it to need to be here for a week? The same thing I'm wondering. Oh, I'm looking instantly. Oh, yeah. Guns. Mm. Oh, there's the black hand. Yeah, that's that guy. Saluto, bandando. Questo è mio nipote. Come ti va? Un business. Ti va buono, ti va buono. Ringraziandoci. He's a big bully, ain't he? Pure te me patri, te ne pare che sia. Quello sono amico. He came in there and got it, somebody a job. Mm -hmm. Vito, He's not gonna be able to employ all of them. E voi ci ha fatto dare tutto il mio. E voi ha stato sempre buono con me da quando ero piccirino. E mi era valente ed ero come un pazzo. E io lo ringrazio. E io lo muscolo. Oh, he yeah. understood. That man's hands were tied. Vito. No. Portici chi sta tu fino. Oh, for his family. Oh, that man felt so bad. He, that's what he could give him. He tried.
<laughs> now at this point, Vic has a family already. Io sogno tua mangia, ce l'hai ancora me cose. Tu vedi steso cucire a rincia. A me ne butta le cose tue, a me non mi interessa. I'm not interested in things that don't concern me. Figlio di puttana, non c'è in casa. Aspetta, aspetta. Minchia, ma cacchiamo la sa. Non creo casa raggia. I'm not believing this. I'm not believing. I'm not believing my first the way he's looking around, that ain't yeah, his friend's house. He's gonna something. hope that person has a rug. V, I'm in a mano, huh? Sit He put his finger up to his lips. This ain't his friend's house. Looks like a cop. It does. You can tell by the, the shape hat, of the hat. The hat, yeah. <laughs> Still got the rug. That's a good thing the cop didn't open the door. <laughs> I forgot it was like, stolen for a second. Looked like a pretty expensive rug, too. Yeah. <laughs> and that was a Clemenza. I believe that's what he said. That was Yeah, Clemenza. we've heard that name in the first mm -hmm. one. If I'm not mistaken, Clemenza in the first one may have been his consigliere thing. Sick, got black and red. Mm -hmm. Now, this is the old guy that came and had the meeting with him, I think. Who they're following? Oh, yeah. Who got him in the Look business? Who got him in the business still? What is he doing? I'm I'm worried for him. Like, why'd you run up there first and then come back? He went in there to check. I that think. seems a little sketchy. I think he went to check to see if it was okay. Come on in. It's all right. Hyman's in there. Oh. I was just making some lunch. Would you like it? It's that guy that nobody mm -hmm. that they're having discussions over. Mr. Roth, come in, Michael. <coughs> Sit down. Make yourself comfortable. It's almost over. He's very casual. So he just seems like he's a mm -hmm. casual old man. I enjoy watching football in the afternoon. One of the things I love about this country. Baseball, too. I love baseball ever since Arnold Rothstein fixed the World Series and I... Fixed? <laughs> ever since the Rothstein yeah. fixed the World Series. I heard you had some trouble. Stupid. People behaving like that with guns. Important thing is you're all right. He seems like a nice guy. Most important thing. More than success, more than money, more than power. Putting stuff in front of the door, turning up the TV so she can't hear probably. Yeah. I want you to know about it before it happens so that there's no danger of starting another war. Nobody wants another war. Frank Pantangeli came to my home and he asked my permission to get rid of the risotto. When I refused, he tried to have me kill. He was stupid. I was lucky. I'll visit him soon. That's who it was? The old man. The other one? Interfere with our plans for the few as a man. Nothing is He went all the way there to warn him. This guy. You're a wise and considerate young man. And you're a great man, Mr. Ross. As much I can learn from you. Whatever I can do to help Michael. Now you can say you see it from my full side about not wanting to go blood over this guy because this man seems like a mm -hmm. honorable, kind, well, as honorable as you can be in the right, business. Right, in the, that business, yeah. But he seems like a nice guy. 
A good guy? <laughs> we will do it together in the next few months. Make history, Mark. History. It's never been done before. Not even your father would dream that such a thing could be possible. And Pantangeli is a dead man. You don't object? These small potatoes. Small potatoes. He didn't even care about taking out pin, pin I hate, I hate. I hate Italian names are names. tough. Because they're said so beautifully, and then, like, my little southern accent just butchers everything. Tangeli. Yeah. We got company, huh? Oh, this is the guy that they said was firing at Michael. I'd be nervous if I was him right now. Mm -hmm. I can't believe he would have people do that, though. I thought he was just drunk. Me too. I didn't realize he was that angry. He knows something's wrong because he knows what he did. I don't understand. I don't look. I don't have your brain uh, for big deals. This is a street thing. And I'm in Roth in Miami. That, he's backing up those son of a bitches. He's blaming on him. He asked me to lay down to him, Mike. I'm so confused. It was Hyman Roth that tried to have me killed. Really? I know it was him. Really? I was sitting here saying he was a good guy. Jesus Christ, now look, let's get them all. Let's hit them all now while we got the muscle. How did he figure, how did he come to that conclusion? I don't know. Keep your friends close, but your enemies closer. Now, if Hyman Roth sees that I interceded in this thing in the Rosado brothers' favor, he's gonna think his relationship with me is still good. Agabi, that's what I want him to think. I want him completely relaxed and confident in our friendship. Because that, that seemed like it was a friendship the way they were talking to each other. My family was. Wow, okay, so I wasn't expecting that. I thought it was the uncle, but I he just went to, to, to the Roth guy to make it seem like they were still friends mm. and everything was okay. Rito, this is Johnny. Johnny Ola, we need some more help. Johnny, oh. Jesus Christ, what the hell time? Who is that? Not Fredo. Everything will be all right, Fredo. Natanjali says he's willing to make the deal. I want to know is if he's on the level or if he's going to bring his boy. You guys lied to me. I don't want you to call me anymore. Your brother's not gonna find out we talk. I don't know what you're talking about. The rat's his own brother. I can tell you right now, I did not. I didn't think that was gonna be the case. I did not think it was gonna be Fredo. Who's that? Uh, wrong number. Duh. That's gonna just gonna hit Michael so much worse when it's Fredo. Hey, I, I got have nobody here. Right in the car, Chich. Frankie. That's okay, Ch Saw the end of the last movie. I don't like the scene of Rosado. I take that as an insult. Michael Cook, ah! and he says hello. <laughs> and they're just staring. They're like, nothing's happening. Jeez, I'm, well, it's a good thing a cop showed up. Ugh. If this had happened someplace else, we couldn't have helped you. When I woke up, I was on the floor, and I don't know how it happened. You can't remember? I passed out. I'll, I'll fix it. Oh. Oh, something bad happened. It's just a game. He, he said senator, too, didn't he? That's the senator. Yeah. This is Carson City. Now, this is Michael's request for your safe. Now, we can send out for anything that you need. I see. So she's stuck there. Mm, it's trapped in her house. Tom, I was going to take the children to New England next week. That's all. Is that it? It's not the way we look at it, Kay. All right. Come on, kids. We're going back to the house. Uh, Joe? I mean, she could very well be her. Sometimes you just want to get it. Sometimes you just want to get away from the house. He's really out and about getting he things is. done right now, isn't he? <laughs> Trying to sell stuff. Trying to get some money. Regional Vice President of the Pan-American Mining Corporation. Regional. 
important men at this table. Mm, top dogs. City of uh, Santa Clara before the new year. Antes del nuevo año. And I want to put you all at ease. We will tolerate no gorillas in the casinos or the swimming pool. <laughs> So like they're both kind of watching each other. I know. I was. I'm trying to figure out what what was that scene. There was definitely some tension. Estamos deteniendo personas dentro de un momento le daremos paso dentro de 15 o 20 minutos. They say that they're making an arrest. You men see that as true. En el cuáquis y vas a bandir. Oh goodness. Oh wow. The Nacional will go to the Lakeville Road Boys. The Capri to the Corleone family. The Sevilla Biltmore also, but Eddie Levine of Newport will bring in the Panino brothers, Dino and Eddie. All these family names and people in the business. And we've saved a piece for some friends uh, in Nevada to make sure that things go smooth back home. I want all of you to enjoy your cake. Enjoy. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Nothing but just millionaires. Mm -hmm. Free to make our profits without Kiefer with the goddamn Justice Department and the FBI. 90 miles away, partnership with a friendly government. 90 miles? Cuba's a very friendly government. <laughs> <laughs> Looking for a man that wants to be president of the United States, having the cash to make it possible. Michael, we're bigger than U.S. Steel. Bigger than U.S. Steel. You imagine that, huh? Two million dollars in the seat next to me in that plane. Thanks, okay, the money. Right. Oh, excuse me. You want to count it? We didn't need to count it because we trust him so much. Mm -hmm. This is a little gift for the president. Oh, well, that's great. Havana's great. It's my kind of town. Anybody I know in Havana? Oh, I'm in Rome. Johnny Olo. He's mm. feeling him out. Listen, Mikey, I'm. Uh... Kind of, uh, kind of nervous from the trip. Uh, can I, can I get a uh, drink or something? I thought maybe we we go out together. I know a place we can spend some time together. Okay. Uh, does he know? I don't know, cause he he's got such a I'm gonna call it a poker face, but it's mm -hmm. way more than that. He's got you can never read him. He knows how to disguise that. Why didn't we spend time like this before? You want a drink, right? Waiter. Think he's gonna tell him? Ugh. Uh, por favor. Tell him in a public place. Does he feel safer that way? Banana daiquiri. That's it. A uh, uno banana daiquiri. Banana daiquiri. And, uh, he knows. You can tell the way. Mm, he's he's kind of looking him up and down. He's good at reading people. For my protection. Before I reach my hotel, I'll be assassinated. What? I heard that right. Uh, so I'm trying to figure it out. Roth. It was Roth that tried to kill me in my home. It was Roth all along. He acts like I'm his son, his successor, but he thinks he's gonna live forever. Roth's played him too, then. Mm -hmm. How can I help? You just go along, I've already made my move. What move? I'm in Roth, I'll never see the new year. You got a lot of moving parts here. No debe excederse. Voy a hacer una prescripción y regresaré mañana. What is he going to do? He says he's not even going to make, make it to the new year. year. Gracias, señor. Buenas noches. Well, if you're sure you're feeling any better. Feel fine. Oh. Play the bingo game. Oh, nice to see you, Mr. Paul. Just make yourself at home. So this old guy, he's kind of just orchestrating everything. But he's in rapid decline. You're pulling out? Just want to just wanna wait. He's pulling out? How do you feel? Terrible. I get four million just to be able to take a piss without it hurting. Who had Frank Pantangeli killed? The Rosado brothers. His auto brother's being after people now. Later on, he had an idea. Build a city out of a desert stopover for GIs on the way to the West Coast. That kid's name was Mo Green, and the city he invented was Las Vegas. Mm. He invented Vegas. When I heard it, I wasn't angry. I knew Mo, I knew he was headstrong, talking loud, saying stupid things. So when he turned up dead, I let it go. What's he getting? And I said to my... He's trying to tell Michael just to let it go, I guess. It's the business we've chosen. I didn't ask who gave the order because it had nothing to do with business. Mm. He said, he's pretty much saying, he's much saying, don't go stick in your nose where it don't belong. Two million in a bag in your room. I'm going in to take a nap. When I wake, money's on the table. I'll know I have a partner. If it isn't, I'll know I don't. I don't know. I can't get a read on this guy. Michael don't trust him. 
No, Michael don't Michael's trust Michael's got a very good intuition. I would have believed that guy the first time when he mm. met him at his home. Right. <laughs> had a party in this movie though. I will give them that. They do everything lavish. Yes. All right, so everybody know everybody here, huh? Oh, I want to see you, Michael. Right, this is Senator Payton from Florida. That's the Malcolm from New York. Fine, right. thank you. Senator Reed from Maryland. Michael. Fred Congo from UTT. And that Fred Erie does a mean cha-cha. Mr. Michael Corleone in the business he's in is shaking hands with government officials of this movie. All these politicians. All these big names. Yeah. Ron Gusto, you got it. Johnny, you don't know my brother Fredo, do you, Johnny? We never met. Johnny Ola. Johnny Ola. Gentlemen, to a night in Havana. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Police. Michael peeped it. Yeah, he's like, hey, that don't mean y'all ain't talked. But I love how Michael peeps things and keeps his mouth shut. He's like, I've stored it. You can see it in his eyes. Can't I'll you? remember that. He's not impulsive. Like when he when he peeps something, it's like the way he looks. Like I see it. Come on, everybody stands. But it's worth it. What? But it's also like he listens to every detail. <laughs> Did I tell you? Did I tell you? That ain't no fake. That's real. That's why they call him Superman. <laughs> Do you hear the way he said, "Did I tell you?" Or "Did I tell you?" <laughs> Johnny Ola told me about this. But seeing is believing, huh? I see it. I smell it. Fifty bucks, Pat. He places like the back of his hand. To watch him now he knows. Crack. Now look at it. Crack. I want to see him break a brick. Oh. I think he was suspicious, but that right there was clear as day. Oh, he just snitched on himself. I don't even realize that he's still talking, yapping back there. Look, he's trying to compose himself. Michael's like... Because as much as he can hold his composure, that's blood. That's, that's his brother. brother. That's his brother. They had his house shut up. His family. His brother's nieces and nephews. Oh, he just said it out loud. Yeah, Johnny Ola brought me here. Bye, Johnny Ola. <laughs> It's that dude who always follows Michael around, like he's quiet. The older Mafia like to use those little wire deals too. Choke him up quiet. Uh -huh. Stealthy. Yeah, quiet. this guy here. He's like Michael's Luca Brasi. Mm -hmm. Remember what happened to Luca Brasi. Whose room do you think he's going into? I thought it was Fredo. I did too. That's what I thought it was gonna be. They're taking him into the hospital, so he's very bad off. He's like the Grim Reaper. <laughs> <laughs> it made like the shark sound when he came back. Yeah, then. obviously, like that's like the Jaws. Vibe. Not as long as we have over one billion dollars invested. Well, the American public believe in love and everything. I'm gonna get me a real drink because I. Can. I wonder how he's gonna handle this I'm situation. You. you know he's heartbroken, and but he still has to do what he needs to do. Because Michael knows that Fredo was in on it, Johnny Ola, and Roth. <laughs> I can sneak away for just a moment. And he was right there waiting. So quiet. I don't even know this guy's name. Who is this guy? I mean, I just know he follows Michael around. He didn't get it. That's who they were coming in for? Michael saw them walking in. I wonder how they knew what he was doing. Remember, Michael told Fredo that Roth wasn't gonna make it to New Year's. Miami in an album, all right? Don't make a big thing about it. I told that Fredo knew you had to go. It's just a good. I know it was you, Fredo. You broke my heart. You broke my heart. Oh, shoot. That was a kiss of death. Fredo can't really cry, can he? I 
I'm just oh I'm sick right now. Fredo looks really really drunk the way he's walking. Fredo did run. Why are people running? Oh, really? the sirens. And the man just resigned from his position. It's about to be chaos. <laughs> We're seeing the, ca the chaos because of Castro. Okay, no one back. What about my boy? Did you get him something for Christmas? I took care of it. What was it so I know? Well, it was a little uh, car with an electric motor that they can ride in. It's nice. He said, let me know so I know. Roth got out in a private boat. He's in the hospital in Miami. Uh, had a stroke, but he recovered okay. Oh, God. Your bodyguard's dead. I asked about Fredo. Uh, I think he got out. He must be somewhere in New York. Fredo's, Fredo's gonna run. He's yeah, he on the run. On. I know he's scared. Tell him everything's all right. Tell him. I know Roth must let him. He didn't know they were gonna try to kill me. Yeah, they can come in now. Well, there was something else. Come on. What? Come on. What? Kay had a miscarriage. He lost the baby. Oh. Was it a boy? Like yeah, three and a half months. Now can't you give me a straight answer anymore? Was it a boy? I really don't know. So much is on Michael right now, man. Holy cow. And now we're going back to his dad. <laughs> in pain. Would they call him black hands? Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's trying to get over on him. Uh-huh. <laughs> He doesn't realize he doesn't have a woman but his wife and kid. Other than that, he don't have family. Di Maranzale in persona per travagliare in astucate. E un giudo galici. Lei ma paga. This man can do anything because everybody's so scared. Si di un pagano niente a fanucci e altro a ragogi pi Maranzale. Lei ma paga. È meglio per tutti gli altri. Non ti preoccupare. They really trying to pay this mm. man. They're not listening to Vito. Vito's only one that's like, nah. Un mera di 50 scudi all'uno per pagare a Fanucci. Vi garantisco che i giù si pigli so che ci rugno io. Quando Fanucci regge riuscendo, c'è niente di fa. Didn't he tell he would accept a hundred? E mi ci sia io io qui. Non c'è bisogno che fate ingazzare chi lo sai se è così malandrino come la città. Ma come fai tu a fare ci pigliare di me? A voi auci un mi interessa. Who is this actor, young Vito? They got a good actor to play Vito. Siamo da gol. Si. Ah. His friend's looking at him funny. Salute. Salute. Clemenza ain't really rocking with it yet. Clemenza is a short guy who always wore the hat, too. In the first one. Is that Robert De Niro? Young Vito? Is that a young De Niro? Ma tu sei sicuro che hai tu riesci di sì? I'm making an offer, he don't refuse. I'm making an offer, he don't refuse. Do you hear the way he's talking? Mm -hmm. I'm making an offer, he won't refuse. Me pare che ci sono 200 scudi sotto il mio cappetto. Eh? Ragione, io. Solo 200 scudi. Tu mi accorti di monete. Che vuoi? Comore su mio senza tavagno. Mi lascia antichi di tempo. Non si, lo capisci, no? It's twice the time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> ah, those little bitch are always scabby. Go back and have your mind with that over here. A tear. Shh. 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 Shh.